How's it going guys? Welcome back. We are back at it. About to continue on right where we left off. I think we get a leave over here. Ooh. Oh. Is this like a timed thing? Yeah. Seems like it. Perhaps we should have interrogated the robot priest. Yeah, next time we encounter a giant, deadly robot priest, we'll tie him up first. And oh, ask wow. Questions. That was just to get. No, then your plan is untenable. That was just to get some loot. Okay. There's an open panel up in the corner there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we just gotta jump across a few of these floaty server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. They contain near infinite stores of data. Pretty sure they can temporarily support our puny mortal frames. Well, mine anyway. Are you cool? And yours too, yes. So, is this another one of Peter's leaders don't go first situations? Really seems like he should be going first. Oh, okay, so we gotta go up here. All right, let's keep moving. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the road not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? His panic scampering is what caused the final break. Your oversized gut is what caused the first 50 breaks. Guys, <laughs> pretty sure it was already cracked. Probably from that giant robot priest mutiny thing. Anyway, can't we just celebrate that we're back on track? Hey, Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Yeah, I don't think that's how it works. Okay, nothing over here. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess makes that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. Locked. I wonder though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next. We're in! You're kidding. Well, yes! Guys, we're in! Go to the criminal records, Quill. I wanna see my files. 20 units, mine's the biggest. They can't be that scary if they share a record. Tracks. I thought there'd be more here. Isn't this your friend from the bar? Another guy from Earth. Fun fact. I am unfamiliar with this creed. One of the nameless. Oh, spooky. Get to the juicy stuff already. Channeling your Nova Force, a comprehensive guide to meditation and managing your mental health. Actually, I wouldn't mind a copy of that. Pass. Let me get this straight. She became a teapot? That's what my source said. <laughs> Amazing. I hate you all. Well, that don't sound good. The audio file must be corrupted. The audio file and everything else in the galaxy. Attention, away team. Please ensure your helmet cams are in full operation ahead of this afternoon's away mission into the quarantine zone. Thank you. Just like Corel, everything by the book. Yeah. It's a list of bucket ads. Check it out. Hey, Wall. She crashed into a Leviathan on purpose and is still a better pilot than Quill. <coughs> uh, we already know your girlfriend works here, Quill. Wow, super riveting, Quill. And to think we could still be reading my criminal record. Please do not. I was wondering how they knew about us. 
Quill must have tripped the sensors on the way out. Isn't that the mining rig from the quarantine zone? Oh, great. Looks like your girlfriend was collecting evidence against us even after the two of you struck a deal. I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocols. It's called stupidity, Drax. Something the Buckethead's got a lot of. Gotta be something in here. Hey, isn't that... The mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone, yeah. Where's the footage from? Signal's stronger. We must be close. How close? Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral! Found something. After we left. Oh, Flark. That thing. You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. I am cool. No, you're a lotus scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. Rocket. That gem Corral picked up? I know you recognize it. It's the one you shot. You're saying this is my fault? Ha! That's real rich coming from you, Quill. I'm just saying. We did this. We freed that... shadow thing. Well, there's nothing we can do about it now. Exactly. Then the Krill I know is a fighter. Maybe she made it out. Yeah. Krill's tough. If anyone could survive that thing, it's her. I know it. Okay. Yeah, that's it for that. Read our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices no. must. I had the check. Groot, write the stars. Grand Unifier, Breaker, right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corral and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. The Matriarch wishes to share it with you. What's wrong with them? 
thinking of? We're stuck here. Hey, at least the dumb skies let's keep our weapons. They demonstrate their lack of fear. It was a proven battle tactic. Katathian warriors often ride into battle completely naked. Keep your pants on. <laughs> Although it could be used as a distraction. Yeah, no. Any other ideas? Can you froth? I can froth. Can you twitch? Yeah, I'm pretty twitchy. All right. On my cue, you drop, froth, and twitch. While they're all distracted, we take off down one of them side halls. What about me? You, well, you know, you, uh, take one for the team. I'm not gonna... Walk with me. Come on, Quill, just grab your chest and drop. Find another plan. <laughs> so, the Matriarch asked for us by name? You, specifically. Although I cannot fathom why. Peter is constantly surprising us, too. But if he's first in line for brainwashing, I gotta say... Is that what you think? That we're brainwashing people? We've met your recent converts. Overly zealous doesn't even begin to describe They them. have embraced the Matriarch's promise. A life-altering experience, yes. But one that must be freely accepted. Quill, his drone. It's her ticket out of here. What? How? What are you two whispering about? <laughs> well? He wants to know if you know you're the bad guy. Uh, actually, we were just admiring how huge this place is it is grand isn't it belief in the matriarch restored it to what it was before the war just as her promise will restore everyone we lost mothers lovers sons this promise will raise the dead of course it won't we can't bring people back we can't but the matriarch, the divine vessel. I got an idea, but I need time. Stall him. Okay, that, uh, that is a cool trick. <coughs> we'll explain how you did it. Sorcery. I can understand how some might see it that way. But I used science. The science of faith. Faith is not science. But faith energy is. This skiff. My inquisitors. Even Sacrosanct herself. All powered by the same miraculous energy. Energy I discovered. I'm going for the drone. Keep him talking. But now? What? What is it? It's just, um... You, uh... <laughs> you, uh, discovered stuff, and you claim to, uh... Control energy? Faith energy? Right. Uh, well, it just seems like all this, uh... uh hold on a sec. You, uh, um, <laughs> this is really embarrassing. You have a, uh, you have something on your face. My what? D yeah, it's like this golden, uh, oily thing on your, you know, face. I was disfigured during an explosion. One of the many tragedies for which I blame him. So, you were saying... Wait. Weren't there more of you? What? No, <laughs> no, no. No, no. Nope. It seems like the kind of thing that we would be aware of. Indeed. Please, continue your fascinating account of... You were saying something about her? It seems super important. The matriarch, I guess? That is not what I was talking about. Are you sure? It seemed like the Matriarch was a thing at some point. She is the second Divine Vessel I was talking about the first. 
The one who refused to reverse the death of my son! But she has come to fulfill that promise. <clears throat> you get off that now. Back with the others. <laughs> what? I was just in my silence! It's time to meet the Matriarch. So, we gotta summon the Milano. Now, if you kept Grand Unicorn talking, I could have answered that. Now we gotta look for a comm relay station. Ridiculous. The ship is exceptionally spacious. Yeah, well, maybe we can ask Will's girlfriend for directions after she's warped our brains. Come on. What? I'm just saying what we're all thinking. This is a really cool looking place. I mean, all the uh, all the environments and uh, in the whole game have been awesome. This is crazy. Vicky. Oh shit. No. As requested, the Guardians of the Galaxy. Thank you, Grand Unifier. Guardians, you may approach. Peter Quill, order your offspring to come down from there this instant. <clears throat> Maybe I'm out of line, but... Aren't you a little young for a dress that short? Aren't you a little old to write your name on your clothes? Uh. Took you long enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, chatty grandpa gets. Hey, we're gonna get you out of here. Just follow my lead. But. This is where we're supposed to be. We're gonna save everybody. I'm gonna save them, I promised. Come on, snap out of it, kid. You're just saying what he wants you to say. Whoa, whoa, hold on, everybody! The just... girl is clearly not herself. Of course I am. But I'm more than just me. Where's your mom? Mom is here. She's right here. Inside me. Oh boy. Oh, thanks for clearing that up. The light joined us. I thought she was gone. But I can bring her back. They're all waiting for us to bring them back. All we need is faith. The Grand Unifier helped me understand. This is one big con. Trust me, I know a thing or two about- Why can't you just believe in me? Why won't you just listen? Nobody ever listens until I show them. Oh, I 
That's how. I knew you would never leave me. I, I, I didn't, I mean... Look at you. Look at you, all grown up. And into the great leader I knew you would become. <laughs> Peter, I am so proud of you. Your father would be so proud. I, I, I don't understand. I, I saw you die. Am I... Did I go back? You are here. That's all that matters. We have all the time in the world now. You and me, and your friends, too. My friends? Sure. The house is plenty big enough. And I want to meet this amazing team of yours and hear all about your incredible adventures. <laughs> <laughs> that is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart, I promise, Peter. I promise. Let go of me. Stop. Stop <laughs> hugging me. I can't believe I have you back. Peter. It's okay. This isn't right. <clears throat> of course it's me, sweetie. It's just been so long. How can you be her? You're not her. <clears throat> That's right, My mother sweetie. died when I was 13. Just let her light in. Let go. You're hurting me. How can you be hurt? Good, Peter. It will all be over soon. No. Stop this. Please. That's right, son. Just... was a little loose. Shouldn't be the cause of the problem, though. I guess that needs replacing. That was weird. Are like new, so that's not the problem. Hmm. Might need to top off the oil. Peter! Dinner's almost ready! Yeah, be right there, Mom! Meredith Quill, where do you keep your carving knives? Oh, there's one in the drawer, nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. We can slice through solid steel. That's very generous, Drax. I just don't know how often I'll be chopping through something that hard. <laughs> I can also supply a few recipes. My wife makes a delicious axe head soup. That sounds hearty. It actually tastes a lot better than it sounds. Our fiercest warriors swear by it. There you are, Peter. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Peter Quill. Your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures? She also told us she had found a suitable mate for you. But you refused to see reason. Drax, you said that would stay between us. <laughs> That's your first mistake, Mrs. Quill. Are you still pushing that Janie thing? She's a lovely girl, Peter, who's turned into an even lovelier young woman. She does sound pretty nice, Peter. Better than all the rest of them, for sure. All the rest of them? Your son is rather promiscuous, Meredith Quill. Dude! Not cool! Sounds like we need to have a serious talk over dinner, Peter. Why do I feel like I'm about to get grounded? This is so weird, dude. I can't believe you still have this. The craftsmanship is shoddy at best. Be nice, Drax. Peter tried. Poultry is very Laura, what did I 
say about putting your clothes in the wash with mine? That you'd be happy to take... It smells great. Doesn't it, though? Drax won't tell me what his secret spices are. What the fuck? That is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart. I promise, Peter. I promise. Let go of me. Stop. Stop hugging me. I can't me. believe I have you back. Oh. Peter. Peter. Ugh. I didn't notice this before. I love you, Peter. What did I do? This is so weird. What is going on? Finally! I need your help. Mom will be home for lunch soon and I want everything to be perfect. Perfect? For her birthday. That's today! Did you forget again? Dad? Uh, no, no, of, of course not. I just don't remember falling asleep. Great. So, can you help me set everything up like we said yesterday? I just need help with the hollow projector. And then, um, there's the cake and the present that we got her. I want everything to be perfect before she gets home. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> This looks amazing. Did you make it? Oh no, I ordered it from the bakery planet. There's a bake. No, I baked it. Okay, that just leaves the present and projector. Dad, the projector. We are still on your mom's ship, right? Of course! You're so weird! Weird doesn't begin to cover it. <laughs> Alright, what else do I need to interact with here? Galaxy's greatest dad. Is that supposed to be me? Obviously. Nick, is it supposed to be fuzzy? Ugh, obviously not. It's not focused right or something. Can you refocus it? Wow. It turned out so good. I was sure I messed part of it up. Wait, did you make this? Yeah. It's hollow and the star system around it, and I think I got all the moons. It's beautiful. Just need mom's present now. I think it's somewhere in my room. That's what I was going to check next if I didn't see anything. Hey, hey! You still have Chewie! Yeah, he's captain of the Milano now. Really? Well, congrats, I guess. Is this 
Is this your hat? You gave it to me, remember? Oh, right. I do not remember this. Alright, what else is there? Happy birthday, love, Nikki and Peter. Is that? Oh, it's right here. Why don't I remember this? Did you find it? Yeah. Okay, put it with the others. Great, a gift. Put it on the table. One birthday present. What did you get her? We got it. On Nowhere. Remember that artist alley we went to and the painting she really liked? Of Cree Lara? Oh. Right. Yeah. Anything else? I don't think so. How does it look? Amazing. Your mom's gonna love it. Thanks, Dad. I love you. Uh, wow. <laughs> Okay, I, uh... Nikki, why is the door locked? It's ma'am. I'll make sure everything's perfect. You get the door. Is that the door? This one. Surprise! Peter? What are you two... No! no! Don't believe it, Peter. This isn't real. She's being tricked. She never should have been here. What she saw. I don't know how, but the three of us are connected now. And that thing, that thing has her, but she can still be saved. Accept my death. She must show her how to let me go. Free my daughter. Save her. Please. Child. Get the matriarch out of here. Rejecting the promise, you have proven yourselves unworthy, and you must be destroyed. Oh shit! No. All right, guys, <laughs> we will uh, we will save this fight for next time. I call the video here. Hope you all enjoyed. The story is really picking up, and I'm digging it. Hope you guys are too. Hope you guys are doing well. Stay tuned. More coming at you. Take care.